हेलो फ्रेंड्स अवर टूडेज टॉपिक इज अबाउट लॉजिकल एड्रेस ऑफ नेटवर्किंग विच नेम एज आई पी एड्रेस सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट वट इज आई पी एड्रेस बट बिफोर आई पी एड्रेस वी नीड टू नो वन मोर टॉपिक हेयर विच नेम इज लैन एंड वैन लाइक वॉट इज लोकल एरिया नेटवर्क and what is wide area network okay so i'm going to start with the local area network first uh, because in both local area network and wide area network we are going to use about ip address okay lan means if devices are connected with each other with same network ids like for example we have two device and they are connected with one cable then they have same network id it means they are lan wide area network means if devices are connected with different network id and another device named router is being used here so the difference between lan and wan is lan is used for small area purpose and wide area network is used for like worldwide connectivity in lan devices are with same network id and uh, switch or hub are using in this lan device but in wide area network router is used with different network id so first of all we need to know about what is a network id because with the help of network id we can make lan and wan so network id is a part of ip address it is a part of ip address so our today's topic is ip address okay so ip address is internet protocol address we have two types of ip addresses are there ipv4 and ipv6 but today i am going to discuss about ipv4 after topics we will discuss about ipv6 ip address is your unique address as well as it is in the form of decimal because computer supports decimal language but on the very start we have discussed about computer that computer is an electronic device which works on 0 and 1 0 and 1 means binary so all the addresses are at very first space these are in binary format so same as ip address is 32 bit address and we have divided it into decimal address so the company which standardized the ip address is named as aina internet assigned number authority and they have divided into four octet like 8.8.8. part and some part in this ip address is network id and some part is host id okay so if we know about binary to decimal let me start with one basic introduction about binary to decimal like for example we have 32 bit ip address then we can understand all bit can be 0 all bit can be 1 and some bit can be 0 and some can be 1 so 0 means 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 One one means one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen, and after that twenty four thirty two. So some zero some one means zero one zero zero one one zero one zero one zero anything. So if we want to get lowest IP address, then we are going for binary to decimal conversion of this bit, and if we need highest IP address, then we need to go for this address for binary to decimal this one binary to decimal so if we go for binary to decimal of zero address then what would you need to know about learn about binary to decimal multiply so each and every bit multiply with 2 raised to power 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 seven like these are the pre uh, prequisites of ccna you need to know about binary to decimal concept at a very first place 
So 0 multiply 2 raised to power 0, 0. Plus 0 multiply 2 raised to power 1, 0. So everything should be 0 here. So if uh, 8 zeros of binary becomes 1 0 in decimal. So 32 0 means our first IP address should be 0 0 0 0 like this. This is my very first IP address in decimal. Okay, understand the concept. Now I am going to des uh, binary to decimal of 1 1 1 1. So you can check here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 multiply 2 raised to power 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so 2 raised to power 0 is 1 2 raised to power 1 is 2 2 raised to power 2 is 4 this is 8 16 32 64 and 128 and if we multiply 1 with 128 then same number will be there 1 multiply 64 same number will be there so when we add these number 255 figure will be there so if 8 bits becomes 255 in decimal then the highest ip address should be this 255 255 255 255 so basically uh, 0, .0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 is lowest address 255, 255, 255, 255. This is my highest address. Like my range should be, my IP address range should be 0 to 255 only. But Aina company divided, Internet Assigned Number Authority divided this IP address into 5 classes. Classes of IP address. A class, B class, C class, D class, E class. The range of A class is 1 to 126. B class is 128 to 191. 192 to 223. 224 to 239. And 240 to 254. So, 0 is missing. 127 is missing. 255 is missing from the range. 0 to 255. 0 is reserved for default route that we will discuss in default routing technique. 127 is your loopback address. Like you want to ping with yourself only. For example, uh, your PC wants to ping with uh, your own LAN card. So we will ping with one command 127.0.0.1. Okay. 255 is reserved for broadcast. So it is reserved for broadcast. Okay. So uh, now range, I will clear this and again watching clear range of IP address A class, B class, C, D and E. Like if any IP start from 1 to 126, it is from A class, 128 to 191 V class, 223 C class, 224 to 239 and 242 to 54. Okay. First C class is used as an IP address in our networking like 1 to 223. D class is reserved for multicasting. It is not used for IP addressing purpose in our PC. E class is reserved for scientific research and recovery. So it is also used by the INA team. So we don't need to discuss these IP address this time. Okay. So, we know that now IP address range, like our starting range was 0, 0, 0, 0 and highest range was this. But in actual that the usable range of IP address is 10002, 128255255255. This is A class, 1290002191, sorry 128 here, uh, here I have to use 126. 128 to 199, 255, 255, 255. This is B class and 192.0.0.0 to 223. These are the actual usable range in our PC. So if we are going to use D class, E class or loopback address as an IP address, it will be uh, not configured. It will uh, gives you error that 127 is used for loopback, 0 is not a valid entry like this. 
so this is the valid range so this is non ip address so this is ip address in next video we are going to discuss about uh, subnet mask and fixed length subnet mask because ip address is only a logical address of pc but we have to make network id and host id first and we have to create lan and wan so we need to discuss about subnet mask in next video thank you